Hi everyone, welcome to our chair-based training routine. I am joined today by my assistant scout. And so what I have is a pair of slightly heavier and then on this side, just a pair of slightly lighter weights. We're gonna go through six different exercises today. First time that we go through all of these routines, I'm going to give you a little bit of an explainer, where you should be feeling it, what to focus on, and then you will subsequently get some built-in rest periods if you're gonna stick with me for the second and third round. So the only exercise that we're going to do today that's standing is going to be a little bit of a balanced exercise. And so this is going to be something where you might want to even have one hand on your chair for a little bit of support. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna hold one leg up just like this. We'll go 10 seconds on each side. What you can do if you would prefer something that involves a little bit less balance, A, just put your hand on the chair like that, or B, you can do a march in place with me, okay? So what we're gonna do is we'll go into, I'll hold that 10 seconds, but you can always do that march, do whatever you feel like suits you the best. So here we go. Holding that up there, and maybe you can hold it up here like this, that's great. Uh, if you can get a little bit higher, go for that too. And hope you're doing that along with me. Scout, how are you doing? You hanging in there? Well, he's doing a good job of keeping his foot from falling off the bench. Let's go ahead and do that other leg. Again, just doing the best that you can. If you gotta put that foot down every once in a while, that's totally fine. Um, this is a good one just for balance. You can practice this too. I, I talked to people and just brush my teeth with this on with one foot up. So that was our standing leg raise. Again, good one to practice. We're gonna go down to the chair now and we're gonna do a seated overhead press, okay? So for this, if you do have different weights, you might wanna go with your slightly heavier weight, okay? So what I'm gonna do is just hold the weights right here and we're just pressing up and right over our head, okay? So this is gonna work our shoulders and our triceps, but if you have any shoulder issues, you can always press out like that instead of straight over your head. So this is gonna be a good one to work on, you know, pushing yourself on, okay? So working on making sure that you're going heavier over time. All right, let's go ahead and do 10 reps together, working our shoulders and our triceps. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, fantastic job. Our next exercise is going to involve no weight, so we can put our weights right down, and it's gonna work our core. So we're gonna do a little bit of a cross body crunch. That means we're gonna bring our right elbow to our left knee, just like that. We'll go 10 and then 10 on the other side. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Great, let's get that other side. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, doing great, seven, eight, nine, and that's our 10. We're going to move into an exercise where, let's go back to our heavy, and let's hold it just like this, and we're just punching straight out, so pushing straight out. That's gonna work our chest too, but also still our shoulders and our triceps. So here we go, we're gonna punch out. One, two, three, four, five. Again, a good one where you can get heavier on. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, awesome job. I'm going to move over to my lighter weights. So the next exercise, it's going to be our curl. Okay, so we're gonna stay seated. We're gonna do a hammer curl, so our palms are facing each other, and that's gonna be working our biceps. So here we go, 10 of them. One, just like this. Two, three, four, as so you can see from the side. Five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, and 10. Great job. One exercise left in, that, in this first round, and that is going to be the cross body chop. We're just gonna go five on each side, working our core again. Start, I'm gonna start on my left side, rotate up to the right side. So let's go five and five, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, great. Other side, one, two, three, four, and five, did great. I'm gonna put that weight down. We will move into the second round if you're gonna stick with me. And we're gonna stand back up. Again, our only standing exercise. And we're going to do that single leg hold. So after we do this one, you will have a rest period. Here we go. Again, just holding that up there, doing the best you can. Maybe you're doing your march. Five, four, three, two. All right, let's switch and get that other leg. Here we go. Three, four, five. This guy's very much asleep. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right. See you back here in 30 seconds. Get your heavier weights ready for the overhead press. Here we go. One, two, remember use the modification that suits you best. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, excellent job. Let's put those weights down. Again, you're not gonna need them for the next one. I'll see you back here in 30 seconds for that cross body chop. into our cross body chop, here we go. One, two, remember doing 10, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, and other side. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. You are doing great. We'll get that single heavy weight for our punch out. See you back here in 30 seconds. Get into our punch out. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Scouts snoring and 10. All right. I'm going to see you back here in 30 seconds with our lighter weight. Hi, Scout. Just be careful for the curls. <laughs>
and let's get into our curls. We're coming to a close on that second round. Here we go, 10 reps. One, two, three, four. He doesn't know it, but he's in for a long walk later. Seven, eight. The more tired he is, the more cuddly he is. Nine and 10. All right, that is great. Um, go ahead, take your break. We have that cross body chop for our next exercise. Last one, cross body jump. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh my goodness, I made you do an extra. That has to be, keep that even. One, two, Scout, you should call me out on that. Three, four, five, Six. Awesome job. I'm going to put that weight off to the side. We're going to move into our third round. It's going to be up to you if you want to stick with me. So um, again, I tell everyone, go ahead, join my strength training support group on Connect if you're watching this from uh, the clinic. And please feel free to ask me any questions in there. So here we go. Last one of our single leg holds. Remember, hold on to something for support. Feel free to do the march if that's what serves you best. Here we go. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, okay, and other side. Here we go. And it's okay if you have to put your foot down. Five, four, three, two, okay, well done. I'm gonna take a seat and I'll see you back here in 30 seconds for that overhead press. Scout, you ready for the overhead press, bud? Okay, I'm counting on you. Here we go, 10 reps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, great. Take your 30 second break. We'll be back here for that cross body crunch. All right, get into the cross body crunch. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Just doing the best you can. Five, if it means you're lifting your leg up a little bit. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Other side. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Awesome job. See you back here in 30 seconds with our heavier weight for the punch out.
Last punch out, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Excellent job. Last curl coming up in 30 seconds. And into our last curl. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. You're doing great. One last exercise left cross body chop coming at you in 30 seconds. Last chop, here we go. One, two, three. I'll stop at five this time. Four, and five, other side. One, two, three, four, and five. Really great job. Way to put some time aside to focus on your health. Looking forward to seeing you on our next strength training routine.